WCD Exports is sponsored by Mountain Dew. Now, Naomi Gray. The day is finally here. College football kickoff in Huntsville. Earlier today, the defending SWAC champions, Alabama a and Bulldogs, opened its season in a matchup versus the SC State Bulldogs. Alabama a and hosting a game on the Hill for the first time since November 2019. And in the last battle of the Bulldogs, a and came out with a 33-7 win. SC State called redemption early first quarter. QB Corey Fields hands it off to Kendrell Flowers for the 14-yard touchdown, an early wake-up call for Coach Maynard's defense. Kick is good. SC State jumps out to the 7-0 lead. Later, Alabama A&M in a fourth down situation, but quarterback Aquil Glass takes a second before he drops back and hauls one up to Zabrian Moore. The 34-yard pass is good for the first and goal. Time to drill the nail now. On the goal line, Glass pops one over the shoulder and connects with D. Anderson for the two-yard touchdown A&M finds its groove to tie things up seven all in the first four minutes of play but it'll be right back to work a couple drives later glass with an opportunity to take the lead he finds an open OJ Hilaire who extends down the sidelines for six then so a kick will be good and Alabama A&M goes up for a 14-7 lead, but fast forward to the second quarter now. SC State will have to settle for a field goal to make it a 14-10 ball game, but they had a lead on their mind. 12-17 on the clock now in the second, Corey Fields scales the field and throws up a 47-yard bomb right into the hands of Shaquan Davis for the first down at the A&M 10-yard line. Third and goal now. Fields tosses it from under center, center to Kendrell Flowers, and he runs it in for the three-yard touchdown. SE State goes back on top, 17-14, and it looks like we're in for a shootout, guys. A couple drives later, AM looking for redemption, and they'll find it. Aquil Glass with the handoff to Gary Quarles as he'll drop it right off in the end zone. Alabama AM goes right back on top. 21-17, but things would be a roller coaster on the next couple drives, so buckle up. SC State with a chance to clap back, but Corey Fields gets picked off by DeMarco Gibson. AM gets the ball right back in their hands, but check out what happens next. Aquil Glass with some extra time in the pocket. He'll break left and find Zabrian Moore trying to escape the sidelines, but he'll get taken down, and SC State forces a fumble. They'll recover and get right to work with less than a minute left in the half. Here we go. Corey Fields puts it all on the line and tosses up the 46-yard deep ball. It'll perfectly fit in the hands of Shaquan Davis. SC State charges to a 24-21 lead at the half. But man, oh man, Alabama A&M will fight to the death in this one and come out with the 42-41 victory. Aquil Glass finished with 426 passing yards and five touchdowns. Here's what him and Coach Maynard had to say after the game. You got to get stops. The only way you can get back and get the lead is get stops. The defense got some stops when they had to. Uh, they gave us some big plays, but when they had to, they got the stops, and then we got the ball back and went down and scored. So, again, our team, we're champions, man. We're not going to quit. We're not going to point fingers. Uh, we're going to do what it takes. We made it a little closer at the end, and the uh, defense got us back. So, uh, like, like I always tell the defense, I got their back, they got my back, and they didn't disappoint. So, I'm just proud of all the guys and proud of, proud of my team.